Okay, here we go. Unboxing mixed tiles. Um, I'm nervous. <laughs> All of the tiles that I bought are the same size. Instead of last year when I bought tiles that were all different sizes from Canvas Champ, this uh, mixed tiles are all the same size. So I'm curious how that looks on the wall versus all the different dimensions that I have there. Um, I spent about four, I don't know, just under $500 on this batch, which is about what I spend on Canvas Champ as well. So price wise, probably pretty similar. All right, let's take a look here and see what we got. I could cry. Really trying not to cry. So what I did this time is instead of just um, mixing up various family members, I did my trip to Alaska. And I took both of my daughters. I took my adult daughter's fiance. Um, I brought both of my brothers and we had this amazing, amazing, amazing holiday, I mean, uh, vacation, Alaska vacation. And, and just looking at this makes me want to cry because it was like such, such an amazing vacation and the tiles absolutely look gorgeous. Wow. Okay. So here's my revelation already. One these are super heavy and clunky these are just like lightweight like paper that's absolutely incredible I'm gonna kind of put them out here so we can see oh my gosh amazing I'm in love I can't wait to see how they go up on the wall but so far I am blown away by how good these are. Now, they're not blurry, even though it said they're gonna make blurry canvases, they're not blurry, although I'm sure that the higher resolution photos would make better um, tiles. So these are nicely boxed and packaged. Nothing is damaged. They've got a cover on them. Okay, so this is another major difference. And here's like in between the layers. Here's another major, major difference. I'm not trying to knock Canvas Champ at all because I've been very happy with them. I'm really comparing the differences in the, in the, um, in the product style. Now, when I got these, they were plastic wrapped. And I had to literally cut open each and every one. And I'm sure that was done to protect them. Where with these, I don't have that problem. This is my favorite picture. Let me just walk you through a little bit what I'm doing here on the screen. So I'm taking down all of the old Canvas Champ pictures. And again, they were absolutely gorgeous, but they did require a hammer and nails. And you can see here that I'm happy to do a lot of work with taking down the hammer and nails. Now the new pictures, you literally just peel off the back. There's a little piece of sticky tape and you can see that I'm simply just pushing them against the wall, barely. I mean, I'm, I'm literally just stick, just kind of tapping it on the wall and it sticks. And then what you'll see is that when I first put them up, I put them all kind of in a block because I wasn't sure how I wanted them. So I put them side by side and I'm literally just peeling them off and moving them around and they're resticking. Now it's a few days later and they're all still hanging up there. I've had no problems. Nothing's falling off. We're coming in and out of the doors. Everything's staying just fine. So you can see here that I went ahead and moved some things around a little bit more and then I'm finished.